Oh man, my camera finna die. What's good, YouTube? It's your boy Jabek, and I'm back with another banger video, man. As you can see by the title and the thumbnail, I will be teaching y'all how to make the flare denim. If you don't know what flare denim is, you clicked on the right video, my guy. My camera finna die. Anyways, you clicked on the right video. So, uh, yeah, let's get straight into the video, man. Shorty key asking like, Chris, what you doing? I told her to sit here for a little run. Stepping that bitch and everybody know my name. Can't lie, I'm the dude in my town. Give it a dick one time, I should keep it. The thing you will need is, you need two pair of jeans. I'm, I got two pair of jeans because I'm going to be making two different colorways of the flat denim, I guess. But uh, I had this all black uh, denim pants from Walmart. And I got these blue jeans from Walmart. And I got these gray jeans. These also from, these all, all these pants are from Walmart. They're like $20, $24, cheap, not expensive. But uh, these are old, I didn't buy these recently, I just, these are old. And then we got some Gorilla Glue. We got Gorilla Glue. Uh, I seen, uh, shout out Dante. I seen him do the, uh, what you call him, the flat denim first. And uh, he used hot, hot glue, but I wanted to try uh, like really glue to see if it'll work easier and uh, you know it'll be better. And then I got some paint, but yeah, I got paint. And after the jeans are done, I'm gonna like flick the paint on them to make it look. I don't know, I don't know. Y'all know how to play them look. If y'all don't, I'll, I'll pop a picture up. But yeah, we got that. You will also need a seam ripper. I don't have mine right now, I don't know where it's at. I'm gonna have to find it. And you will also need a pair of scissors. I don't know where they're at either, so I'm gonna have to find both of them. But yeah, let's get straight into the video, man. All right, YouTube. So as you can see, I got my seam ripper. I found my seam ripper. You see right here. What you want to do is take your seam ripper and you want to go through and cut the thread so where it's not really, it's not folded up like this no more. So we're gonna do that, and I'm gonna come to you. I'm gonna come back when it's done. All right, YouTube, we back. As you can see, we have done taking out the seam on these jeans and after they should look like this. This is probably the most time consuming part. This took me about probably like five minutes. But yeah, after you're done taking out the seam, it should look like this. Now what you wanna do is repeat that for the same leg. But for the time sake of the video, I'm going to just show y'all how to do everything on one leg right now. So what you want to do is, you want to take, what I'm going to do is, I'm going to cut shorter on the outside part of the pants leg, and I'm going to cut uh, longer on the inside. And we're just going to cut along this line right here. We're just going to cut along this line. All right, YouTube, as you can see, we got our extra piece of fabric. So now what we're gonna do is just lay it. We're gonna take it. As y'all can see, we're gonna take it and just lay it inside of the pants like this. Have it out a little bit. But y'all wanna make sure it lines up Kind of sort of lines up at the bottom. We're gonna take oh snap the gorilla glue and make sure y'all make sure y'all be careful if you're using the gorilla glue because y'all can really mess yourself up. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna just put it 
on the inside of the pants and then after that I'm gonna just lay it down like this and try to make it stick make it stick like the best it can Alright, YouTube, as you can tell, it is the next day. Uh, I finished the jeans last night, I just didn't feel like recording, and plus, I had to charge my uh, camera battery. But, anyways, don't mind the bag in the back. That's something I had to get today, but these are the jeans right here. I finished them on, I think it's on the, the left side. I think the left side, yeah, the left side is not that good. The right side is way better because on the left side, it's my first time doing it. So, it was like a trial and error process. I didn't really know what I was doing, but they're way better on the right side. But I'm gonna show y'all what they look like on so y'all can get a better representation of how they look. And I think if I would have done it right on both sides, or well, on the left side, it would have came out fire, to be honest. But yeah, I didn't even do the paint splatter yet. I might do it, I might not do it, depending on how I feel. But yeah, let's get straight into the B roll. All right, YouTube, that will be the end of the video. If you made it this far, make sure you like, comment, subscribe. Let me down, let me know down in the comments if you're new. You might be new, you might not be new. But if you are, let me know in the comments. And make sure you drop a follow. Go share this video with all your friends, all your family members, anybody. It don't even matter. All my socials are going to be down in the description below. But yeah, stay tuned in for the next video. I don't know when it's going to drop. I don't know what I'm dropping next. But let me know in the comments down below if I have any uh, video ideas or if y'all want to see me do anything. If y'all want to see a QA, and a If y'all want to see a, a vlog. I don't know. I'll try to do a vlog one time, but I don't know. I just did my life. Just not just... Anyway, yeah. It's your boy, J-Big. And I'm out.